Attorneys for ghost ship defendant Max Harris declared that today was the first time a judge acknowledged that their defense has merits. It seems as though the court's leaning towards releasing Mr. Harris on bail uh, based on um, new law and the circumstances in which we want to introduce him back to the public. Harris's attorney offered to use his own money to help pay for Harris to be released from jail into a sober living facility with an electronic ankle monitor based on a new landmark state court ruling requiring judges to consider alternatives to jail for criminal defendants who can't afford cash bail. Harris, along with Derek Almena, the founder of the arts collective known as Ghost Ship, are each charged with 36 counts of involuntary manslaughter for the fatal fire back in December 2016. Today, a judge turned down a motion to dismiss those charges. Almena's wife believes her husband is being scapegoated. I'm really disappointed that the motion got dismissed today. I think that I, I, I don't think that was right. But Almena will have a chance to speak in court. We intend at trial to put our client on. So Mr. Almena will be testifying, and he'll be testifying on his own behalf. Attorneys are also pushing for an evidentiary hearing before the trial judge. Was, the evidence was moved several times. There were some spoilage issues. There was rain. There was mud, the chain of command, and that's what they're going back and forth on. If you don't have evidence, how do you prosecute somebody? Max Harris will be back in court on May the 24th for his bail hearing. The ghost ship trial itself is set for July 16th.